there's no turning back. It's not like those other situations. I'll say at that point, it wasn't even about battle rap or any of that. It was just the, the, the information was too shocking. It was. It's Mac. What's going on y'all, it's C-Mac from Seattle. In today's video, Drake finally decides to speak out about this whole beef situation and it's pretty self-explanatory. So I'm just gonna get straight into the video and I'm gonna let y'all know what I think about it after this video. Check it out. And I have no problem with any of these guys. I don't even know these guys like that. <laughs> this is a sport at the end of the day and you know from a very early point, I've never shied away from defending myself. Mm -hmm. And I'm also sometimes eager to engage if I feel that you want to be slick or be offensive behind the scenes. I might choose to address it in music. And you know, that was how I ended myself. No desire to ever mend anything with that person. And um, yeah, that situation just went, you know, it went, it just went, it just went where it went. And it's just, there is no, there is no, there is no turning back. It's not like those other situations. I'll say at that point, it wasn't even about battle rap or any of that. It was just the, the, the information was too shocking. It was, like I said, it was, it was a, on his part, it was a genius chess move. He obviously had, he's making up about my mom and my dad and all this like dumb mm -hmm. shit. Or, uh, or, you know, obviously the part that, that hit me the most, which is like, you know, wishing like that my friend, I'm just not really with that. Like, and when I did say, oh, there's rules to this. I didn't mean there's rules that anybody has to follow, but like in battle rap, you know, rapping about, you know, that type of shit. And it's just, it just is what it is. There's a point where, there's a point where you're gonna wanna stop rapping. I'm sure I could say something about, you know, your lovely lady or, you know, a child or a family member, and you're just gonna wanna not really rap anymore. Yeah, um, so that's just kind of where, that's just kind of where I got to. It's just, I just had to admit like, yo, I'm, I'm really, you know, and, and when I was making when I was making the record in response, which was a real record, I know people think it's like some myth. Um, it was like on this vinyls beat, and I just found myself saying things that like one seemed really out of character, just because I was like deeply invested in the situation and getting very angry, um, and saying things that I didn't, I don't know if in two years I'd want to hear myself say, and uh, realized that like nobody cares about this guy, so it's not really much. I can say big, better than Drake has a baby. I, he won, you know, he won off that, off that, uh, off that bomb. You know? I, I, I had a, I, I had, at the time I was working with Adidas and we were toying with the idea of a name being a play off of a name, uh, off of my son's name. I wasn't revealing my son with Adidas <laughs> or like, I wasn't going to have my son yeah. like, you know, <laughs> right. Um, but yeah, no, I was just, um, you know, to be honest with you, uh, I actually did a DNA test for my son and, um, and they came back to us and they said that the DNA test got ruined in transit um, and that they couldn't be 100% sure that that was my son or not. Um, so I was in a really weird pending situation where I didn't want to go tell the world mm. um, that that was my son and it wasn't. You know, if you see my boy, yeah. you'll understand, like, you know, at the time I was like, I, I mean, he's just, he's, I mean, he's just a stunning child, yeah. you know, with the brightest blue eyes. And at the time I was like, I don't know, <laughs> but you know, it wasn't until, it, it actually wasn't until a week before the album came out that I got confirmation that that was yeah. definitely my son. It took yeah. me two more solid tests with two different companies. Yeah. So they're all just like fabricated. So yeah. just to make it more interesting, yeah. the story is actually not really that interesting. The biggest part of it is that I have a son. But it wasn't like, oh, I'm hiding him. Or he has a point. He can say, yo, you brought up my lady's name. Oh, all bets are off the table. That's fine. You know, like I said, we all think differently, right? right. Mm -hmm. And even like, you know, even in even in the me and Meek situation, if you listen back to those records, we like <laughs> we didn't really go that, and we left Nick out of it, and we left kind of family out of it mm. for the most part. Whether whether there was information that didn't get revealed or not, the point is like, I, there's just some unwritten rules in the sport for some people obviously yeah. not for him and that's fine you know um and he's just made an entire career off of it you know and some people like his music i personally don't because yeah sure i'm sure i i'm sure i was you know again a fan and and obviously more 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 so just a fan of like pharrell and neptunes i always wanted to be signed to star trek and stuff like that i was like the way but yeah i mean you know now that i'm 
grown up and I actually know him and the tr truth is just kind of like, I don't know, it's not, not as appealing as it once. You know, I think that he definitely recruited a guy with a similar dislike for me, no matter what he says for him or whatever, but it's not love, you know, it's, 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 there's something there um, that bothers him deeply. Uh, and yeah, I can't fix it for him. So yeah. um, it just is what it is. Um, I can never, ever, ever, ever turn my back on the things that I've said about him in a positive light. And I After watching the full video, I ain't gonna lie. I done heard everything I need to hear. I don't wanna hear no type of arguing after this. I'm not even gonna tell y'all my opinion. I'ma leave it to y'all in the comments. So, hey, let me know what you think about this whole interview and like, share, subscribe, and all that other good shit for more videos like this. Hi.